Hey guys, Grady here. It's a beautiful night tonight. It is. Truthfully, it is. Um, just appearing on cam to talk about something important. So, there are, um, there was a customer I had today, and, um, you know, I know him personally, and I said to him as a joke, oh, cool, you bought me a donut, and he said, no, I didn't buy you a donut. I'd take your hand off with a machete if I had, if you tried to steal it. And I'm like, really? Like, really? What's the, what's the matter with people? You take somebody's hand off with a machete because they steal your fucking donut, really? Talk about childish and stupid, guys. God. Makes me so fucking upset. It does. It makes me very angry that we are allowing this in our world. There's the sunset. It does. It makes me very angry and very upset. I don't understand why he had to be that way. Why? Do, really? Guys, this isn't, this is why I did not vote for Donald Trump, because he's encouraging his supporters to say stuff like that, and, you know, and he's turning us against each other. You know, you Republicans, man, you just blame the damn Democrats for everything, don't you? And you damn Democrats, man, you blame the Rogocious Republicans for everything, don't you? What's the matter with you people, really? You, you people. You people are the fucking problem. I'm not part of the problem. Because I know who the problem is, and it's you guys. You guys are all turning against each other, which is what Trump wants you to do. And he wants us to be distracted. So that someone else can step into power over the world. And we better, we better hope that it's not North Korea. Guys, this is a big problem. You know, if we're going to be leaders of the free world, we need to go by example. And us pointing fingers at each other and acting like fucking children, that's not going to help. Guys, this scares me. It does. Hello. Have a good day. You know, it bothers me. It does. You guys aren't bothered by it. I'm, honestly, I'm not too sure why. But you, you don't care. You don't care. This is, you know, this is why I'm, you know, I don't think I can ever vote ever again, honestly. If it's, if it's come down to this, like, this is not the example that I want to be setting for our children. I don't want our children to be given the example that we should be pointing fingers at each other, blaming each other for all the bad problems. Whoa, that is cool. I don't want that, guys. That is not what I frickin' want. You gotta be joking. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You guys have gotta be joking. This isn't normal. It's not. It's not normal. We shouldn't be doing this. Guys, this makes me very sad. Makes me sad that I'm seeing my country fall right apart at the seams. And all you pansy-ass fuckers don't even know what's going on. Because you're just so damn busy pointing your fingers at everybody and blaming them. Grow the fuck up. Work together. Aren't we supposed to be the United States? We aren't fucking united. It's because you crazy fuckers are all pointing fingers at each other. Blaming each other. Stop blaming one side. Okay, it's not just the fault of one side, it's everyone. You motherfuckers need to realize that, but you don't, because you're all st You know what? I think you're all just a bunch of stupid idiots. I, I do, I think that. This is why I don't- this is why I'm a socialist. I don't think I can ever vote Democrat or Republican again. I can't- I can't- I can't handle this, guys. This is- you know, this is a big deal. It's not a problem for you. It's clear that you guys, you clearly don't care about morality. I don't care what side you want. Say whatever you want. Oh, Democrats are that way. Oh, well, Republicans are that way. No, they're not. You guys just constantly blame each other. <coughs> All you do is you blame each other. Why can't, why can't you guys be more like John McCain? Huh? 
Why do you have to feed into what Trump wants? Trump wants you guys to, d to be divided. He wants us to be divided. I'm not going to allow that to happen. You need to work together, okay? You need to work together. Quit being fucking jerks to each other. I'm serious. Because this is not making the situation any better. If you guys actually took steps to be nice to each other, maybe people would be nice back. I'm just saying this out of brutal honesty. You've got to be fucking joking right now. This is, this is not freaking cool. This is a huge issue. You people aren't bothered by this, guys. I want us to focus on what's important. I don't want us to focus on tearing each other apart at the seams, which is what's happening to our country, and that's been happening ever since we elected that fucker into office. That's what's been happening. He's been tearing us apart at the seams, tearing us against each other. He wants you people in his base. He wants you to be racist. He wants you to do hateful, abusive things. You just don't realize that. Because you all listen to that opinionated garbage Fox News crap. And, you know, Infowars crap and all that. You're fucking joking. You can't see what he's doing. You guys, you say all those hateful names. And then you lose your fucking minds when the Democrats do the same. Hey, how does it feel, dude, huh? You guys need to think before you fucking speak. I think you all are a bunch of idiotic crybabies. I'm not joking. You people all make me sick. You do. I'm tired of this, okay? I don't, this is not the example we should be setting for our children. You've got to be joking right now. This is like the biggest problem that we have is all this division. I, I can't, I can't say United States. We are not united. Definitely not united. We are as divided as can be, and you know what? That's your fault. Because you guys are being very, very rude, disrespectful, and racist towards the other sides. It, it doesn't matter. You guys, you can't find common ground on anything. You just have to constantly attack each other. Leave it the fuck alone, okay? Get the fuck over it and grow the fuck up. I think you all are just a bunch of crybabies. Wah! Grady's saying stuff on his YouTube channel and on his Twitter page about how we're not helping what? You need to unsubscribe or unfollow and grow up. I'm dead serious. You guys don't fucking care. What's the matter with you people? Gosh, you people make me sick. You do. I'm telling you this because I care. I am saying this because I care, and I do care. I care very deeply about each and every one of you, and that is why I don't want us to be like this. That is why I don't want this for our country. I want us to work together like we're supposed to. We're supposed to set that example right now. We ain't doing that. And you guys have nobody to blame but your own selves. I'm willing to work with anybody. I don't care who they are. Even if they're a Trump supporter, I'm willing to work with them to make the country better by doing good things. I don't care about a fucking wall. I don't want a fucking wall. Screw the wall. Okay? We're going back to like what Nazi Germany was. Like really we are. Trump is totally a dictator. You're joking if you think he isn't. You are fucking joking. Guys, this is bad. This, like this, this, this scares me, okay, and it really, it really is worse when, if you really think about, you know, what's been going on, like, with him and, you know, other countries, like, what if Russia did take over? Oh, what, you wouldn't fucking care? Really? Do you know what Russia has done to their people? Do you know what North Korea has done and still does to their people? You guys are fucking joking. You are all a fucking disgrace. You're the biggest disgrace that our country has. Because you're all just turning, you're all just turning us all like, Robert, get over here. Come on, dude. Don't, don't do that. You know better. You're going to get killed if you do that. Sorry, guys, I had to correct him. I didn't hit him, though. Don't worry, I don't do that. But guys, really? 
Like this is this is the message. What type of message does this send to the youth of our nation? Not just our nation, but the nations that we're allies with. Like everyone relies on us. And if we're all just gonna be like crybabies, you know, and act like children and point fingers at each other, then maybe, maybe, you know, maybe we shouldn't be a country anymore. Maybe we should, maybe it would be a smart idea to be like Nazi Germany or like, you know, be like Marx or Lenin. But no, I don't believe in that because I see a brighter future way far off, but I still see one. You guys are a fucking disgrace. You all make me very sad. I don't want to feel this way. This is why I don't care about freedom. This is what this is where freedom has gotten us to being a divided nation. And you cannot blame anybody but the Democrats and the Republicans for that. Nobody else did that. It was the Democrats and the Republicans and you Democrats and Republicans, you have nobody to blame but your sorry selves. You know what? I really think that you all can't just you just can't face certain facts. Hold on, guys. I got to My hand is almost frostbitten. But you guys, you don't freaking care. Okay? And that's a big problem. I don't know why you guys don't care. Hold on. But you don't freaking care. What's the matter with you? What is the matter with you people? Like what what type of nation have we come to? Not a good one. We're we're a terrible place, okay? I don't want that to be the example set for future generations of our nation or any nation that we're allies with. Even Russia is doing things better than we are when it comes to that. They're not all pointing fingers because they know the source of all their problems. It's Putin. You guys don't fucking realize that it's yourselves. You all are acting like a bunch of idiots. If that offends you, then oh well. You know, and if you don't like what I'm saying, then click the unsubscribe button or click the unfollow button or block me. I don't fucking care. This is the honest truth. We are failing miserably and it's because you people refuse to be respectful or nice to one another. You people are the reason why our country is failing. Why it's going down the tank. That's... I can't... I can't fucking handle this, guys. I can't... I, I, you know, and if that's really the way it's gonna be, then why would I ever vote again? In all honesty, why would I ever vote again, period? <laughs> Robert, stop it! Why would I ever do that? It makes me very upset what you guys are all doing. You don't care. And that's a big problem for me. It's not a problem for you. You're not bothered by it, but I am. Okay? I mean, in all honesty, I wouldn't mind if, like, China took over as the leader of the free world, but, like, North Korea, really? Guys, if North Korea takes over as being the leaders of the world, every we're all screwed. And you people pointing fingers at each other, doing all that fucking name calling, that's not gonna fucking help. This scares me, guys. This fucking scares me. And you idiots aren't fucking helping. You're all just a bunch of crybabies. That's all you are. You cry and whine when things don't go your way. Get over it, okay? Things ain't always gonna go your way. That's just the way it is. Get the fuck over it, okay? If we are to survive better as a nation, then we need to do better, and I don't see us doing that. Listen, guys, I said all that because I care, and I do. I do care so much, but you guys don't, and that's a big problem for me. You all have a relaxing night and a peaceful night, and enjoy your holiday season. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.